Bowling Green State University football team is in its seventh day of spring practice. The baseball team is about 30 games into their schedule, and there's only one guy who is on both rosters, Eastwood High School alum Clay Rolfe. Our Adam Solomon did his best to catch up with the Pemberville native. A bird of a different color. Former Eastwood Eagle and current Bowling Green Falcon Clay Rolfe is on scholarship to play football at BG. And after morning practices, Clay, well, let's just say he puts a whole different meaning to the phrase two-a-days. I feel good. I feel excited. Got a good morning in. Now I'm going to go get a little lunch, go to a few classes, and then uh, have a good baseball practice. Yes, you heard him right. The 6'6", six 275-pound six, tight end also plays first base for the BG baseball team, who happened to practice in the afternoon. At times it gets a little hectic, but uh, I like to stay pretty organized on top of my classwork, so uh, I've gotten into a little groove, and uh, it's fun. I mean, I'm excited, and I, I, I love, have, love doing this each day. With a specially ordered baseball uniform for the big man, Clay got together with his coaches to see if and how this could even work. It came up in the recruiting process, and we recruited Clay. Uh, we said that he could, he could not do baseball the first year, but the second year, if he had done a good job in the classroom, and had worked hard in the weight room and done all the things we had asked of him that we would uh, discuss it. You know, so we made the uh, agreement he could play. Danny and I, Coach Smith, just work uh, weekly in terms of the conflicts. It's nice when you have other coaches that uh, that support uh, so support each other's programs. And and like I said, if you get a talented guy like Clay that can has the ability to play both sports, uh, you know that's that's a win win for both sports. What about the uh, the coaches? What's, what was their reaction uh, when when they had to realize that they had to figure everything out? Uh, I hope. Excitement. They seemed excited for me, and uh, I, they they were excited to give me the opportunity. And as long as I kept working hard, and uh, I'm just going to keep working hard, and whatever happens is going to happen. Despite some timing obstacles, well, he may not travel when we travel to Western Michigan this weekend, but we're home against Central the the following weekend. So Saturday morning he'll have football practice. I'm sure he'll go in, shower, grab something to eat, and head right out to the baseball field to get ready to to go against the uh, the Chippewas. Clay's attitude, work ethic, and talent have made it all worth it. When we first recruited Clay out of high school, you know, one of the concerns in recruiting him was we thought he may get drafted for baseball, we may never get him. So uh, it was that athleticism that attracted us to Clay from the beginning. Do you plan on playing both sports all four years? Uh, yes, I plan on playing both sports till they tell me I can't play anymore. From Bowling Green, I'm Adam Solomon, WNWO Sports.